Hey y'all, it is June 19th and I have a really exciting day ahead of me because I have an event to go to tonight and I'm pretty sure, I think it's a blogger event, I'm not sure. Basically, I got invited to go take a picture, enjoy the event, get some free goodies. Um, so in my mind, I think that's like a blogger event. But if it is, this is going to be my first ever blogger event. Technically, I went to one in Atlanta. It was like a rosé company. But honestly, I feel like I don't count that one because it wasn't like a fashion brand or like a jewelry brand. Um, today, I'm going to a Kendra Scott event. I said it in last night's vlog, but... This store is like so beautiful, like every little place in the store is so photogenic. And I know this because I've been stalking Austin, Texas this whole time before I came here, obviously. And so many people take pictures in the store, near the store, outside of the store, like it's so pretty. So I'm very excited to be finally going. And it honestly just worked out perfectly because I wanted to go anyways. Currently Ryan's playing golf. Um, I think he's going to be done soon. I finished cleaning up my closet. I didn't vlog too much of it because I was just really trying to stay focused and not get distracted with like camera stuff because I it needed to be done. And I'm so glad. I definitely think that Walmart bin helped me out. Um, that was a good call. Today I'm planning on getting a vanity from this girl on let go it's like 70 bucks and it's like white and just really nice has like a lot of storage for makeup um so i really want to get it and i think it's like north austin i mapped it it said it was like gonna be 20 minutes which isn't horrible because i think we have some errands to do anyways and i still need to go to ulta and i was gonna do my makeup like later in the day so it could be like more fresh but I feel like with my skin, or like, I don't know why this happens. I feel like my makeup looks really, really good right when I do it. And then like the middle of the day, it doesn't look that great. And then once it like soaks into my face, it looks so natural and good. Does that make sense? So I'm just hoping for the end of it to be at the event and it looks good. So I don't know. I don't know. We'll see how my makeup does. Um, today it's supposed to be like 100 degrees. So that's great. I'm not looking forward to going outside. Last night I stayed up till literally 1 or 1.30 because I just got the urge to just look at so much like um, filming room stuff. Like I wanted to buy so much stuff but oh my god my Amazon account literally it said $400 and I was like what the hell did I just add to my freaking Amazon account. It was insane. <laughs> so I had to delete like literally everything. Well I put it in the save later just in case I you know, actually needed it down the road, but that was a little insane. So I think I do want to go to TJ Maxx if we have time to scope out like any decor items they have. But honestly, I just don't know like which side of the wall I'm going to film on. Like at first I wanted to do it in that corner, but the bed is there and like we don't have a headboard and the bed's on the floor right now. And it's just, I don't even know what to do. All right, I'm going to stop rambling and I'm going to get started on my makeup. So I'm finished getting ready. Did my makeup, just did my hair. Um, my hair was like a little damp from last night because I showered last night. Um, but I think it turned out really nicely. Like it's not too curled, but it's, I don't know. It's going to fall really good because it's really hot outside. We're going to go get my vanity. It's 20 minutes away. And... It's 92 right now. It feels like 102. Damn it. I don't think I'm ready for this. So we are headed to pick up my vanity. I'm really excited because it looks really nice and very useful and I have a vision for my videos and I definitely want to do more makeup videos so I wanted to get this so I can actually have like a table in front of me um because I've never had like a table in front of me I always like literally put all my makeup on my lap and just like filmed in a chair we got the goods y'all I'm so excited it looks so nice and clean and white even Ryan said it's a nice table
meal plan was enough to get me a little chunky. I don't know what would happen if I had a water burger right in front of me, but all right, let's try this taco place. This is what I imagined Austin being like, not over where we live. Like Probably all this? Is, yeah. We're going to that shady spot over there. It's too hot for this. It's potato, egg, and cheese. And they're really small. They were, what, $2 each? Three for five. Three for five. So, let's try these bad boys. Pretty good. A little stale. Our first food truck, right? I don't know, actually it is. Our first food truck in Austin. The sign of Tiffany's was pink. That's such a millennial thing of me to do, like just be like drawn to pink signs, you know? And then like when you come in, like it's not very trendy and not very girly, not very pink at all. Like it's just a food truck with this, this, this in it. So, you know, whatever. So it is almost event time and we are getting ready. We're like a little bit frazzled because we've never been to one of these events before. So especially Ryan, like he doesn't know what to wear because I don't think many guys go to these things, but I could be wrong. Hopefully there's people for him to talk to, but I heard there's beer there. So hopefully that will be enough for him. So I'm actually going to touch up real quick with my studio Mac Fix powder in the color NC43. This is definitely my lighter shade, but I just thought I would go on my highlight points because I did get a little greasy outside eating in the food truck and just in the weather in general. Um, just did that. I don't know what color I should wear. Like I wanted to be like summery and fun and like, you know, try something new out, but I don't know guys. I think I'm going to have to resort to my browns. So I think I'm going to layer this on top. This is the True Story by Morphe, the liquid lipstick, and it's really pretty brown. It's currently 4.55. We're supposed to leave at 5 because I need to be there at 5.30 and I want to be like early-ish. I don't know how long it takes to get there. Literally in the last 10 minutes before we had to leave, I get my period. <laughs> And Ryan shaves his neck and gets all these like razor burn splotchy red things. So we're we're doing great right now. First blogger event. Yes, it's going great. <laughs> but I'm gonna pop some Tylenol because I'm the type of girl that I like to prevent stuff before it happens. So I'm not dealing with any cramps today. Who's ready for their first event? Me. <laughs> I'm, I feel like I'm underdressed and kind of worried. Been freaking out this like, whole time. Are you wearing like a girl in front of this? I don't know. I'm I'm as confused as you. This is what I'm wearing. I think I already showed you guys. What patch of my beard looks in the camera? It says it's a 15 minute drive, so you timed it out perfectly. Also, another bad thing. Well, it disappeared now, but there was a water stain on my dress, so. We are on our way to the Kendra Scott flagship store. I'm really excited to see it. Like I said before, it's so photogenic, so I am picture ready. I'm feeling good about myself, even though, you know, Mother Nature decided to greet me today. But, you ready for some pictures? Take them or be in them? Both, maybe. I'm take them. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. Um, but this, uh, this store is on South Congress. Avenue? Congress Avenue? Oh, Congress yeah. Avenue? South? I don't know. Anyways, uh, and that's like a really cool street, right? It yeah. has like a lot of cool What's stores and stuff. Yeah, I agree. We made it to the event. So cute out here. My name's Eva, I work at the Kendra Scott flagship, and I'm gonna take you guys on a tour. This place is so beautiful, it's insane. We'll start off. Oh my god, let's go. This is so pretty. Well, we've been open since November. It's really, really hot out. Just November? Just November, we're oh, brand new. Wow. So, this is our first summer, and it's 
Yeah. It's hot. Yeah. <laughs> so we just launched our freshwater pearl collection today, which is really exciting for the company. It's a timeless piece and it can be great for anyone and it's not just your grandma's pearls. <laughs> This is really cool. It's wallpaper that is. Oh, pendant. I saw this. I don't know where I saw it, but I did see it. Yeah, it's now so in cool. all of these stores, but it's Kendra's designs and the designers. It's their actual handwriting and their random quotes. So we're launching our new summer um, three collection, which is all full of freshwater pearls. So we're doing a fun um, pearl-inspired candy bar, as well as um, pearl-inspired drinks in our cafe. That is cool. You gotta get a frosé. Okay, yes. So we are at the color bar. I had no idea this existed, but it does. And it's so cool. So basically you can like customize your own jewelry. And so I think I am gonna go for it. I have this gold ring. I'm a size eight, a little chubby finger, but. So I have the Calvin ring on right now, and basically you can just pick any stone to fill it in with. And I think I'm more of like a neutral girl, so I think I'm gonna like stick to all these neutrals in this corner right here. We're getting the stone set in. got back from the event and I got a new ring and I got a new candle that a candle. might <laughs> I even picked a candle out that I liked I was like damn this is good it might be my favorite scent ever might trump capri capri scent pink wait what is it called oh, don't even say pink <laughs> sands around me pink sands is like um is it yankee candle I think it's yeah, yankee candle so and I had a pink sands car freshener like for a really long time and it was really like it gave you a headache it was so powerful i can't even like see the name pink sands without like almost gagging so like i said i got this ring and i think she said this was the calvin ring and it was really cool because i got to like customize it so i did pick the white stone um and i'm really excited because this is like one of the nicer rings i own he bought me some off of etsy and i think they're like good quality too mm -hmm. but all the other ones they just turned on me and they were like gold plated or I don't also even bend really easily it's yeah weird. yeah this is like, let me see very I didn't, thick I didn't, let me feel it this is nice I'm excited to edit this vlog because I think I got some really cool b-roll plus I did it with my new camera so I'm really excited about that and Ryan took really good photos of me so shout out to my Instagram boyfriend I love getting the recognition people are like oh my god I can't believe you actually do this and I'm like I can't believe it either but I can't <laughs> Yeah, he's a good sport, but right now we are gonna go do another let go transaction, <laughs> y'all. I'm she, I'm on my let go. Has to be like three thousand dollars of just random stuff she's bought. You you may not be wrong, but I am getting this like chair. I don't know. I saw it on Pinterest last night, and I was so into it that I'm getting this freaking chair, y'all. And we're gonna hop into my car because my car is like a SUV um, and Ryan's car is a car, a sedan. So he can't carry shit. Um, but I'm really excited. I just have this vision for my filming room. Like I want it to be like boho. So we're gonna try to go for that. And this chair is gonna be $25. It's not a wicker chair, but it's kind of like that style. So I want to kind of make it like a boho wicker style chair. Got the goods, y'all. Let go, queen. Hello. Perfect fit. Thanks, babe. 
So we are home. We went to the grocery store really quick because I'm going to make something special for Ryan um, tomorrow morning because it's his birthday. So he's literally turning 22 in a couple of hours. How do you feel? Old. Oh, I should feel any different, really. Yeah. I don't know why. I feel the exact same. After 21, nothing exciting happens. So. I agree. We had a really fun day with Kendra Scott. And I'm really hyped about my chair. Let me just give you a little sneak peek. Ooh, it's actually pretty yeah. cute. Ryan said it was like a lake house chair, but you know, I'll take it. I think it was a pretty good find for $25. And like, I thought this looked a lot dingier on the um, picture that she showed. Also, I don't get why people use blurry photos to sell their shit. Like, hello, photos are everything. Take good photos and I'll buy it even sooner. But... Yeah, so this is the chair. It's really cool. I mean, it looks really comfy. I might get like a new cushion, but honestly, I feel like just slapping a nice pillow on it will make do and like putting one of these throw blankets over here on it, I think it'll be good. So I'm about to FaceTime Laura and catch her up for my whole day and I'm gonna take my makeup off. So I'm going to end the vlog here and I'll see y'all tomorrow for Ryan's birthday, yay!